Hello guys and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Brutal Doom. In this episode we're going to start up the Hell Chapter, Inferno. A rather difficult chapter at first. It starts hard then gets much bit easier. Why is that? Because we have very low supplies. And I mean very low supplies. Don't be fooled by the bunch of ammo we just picked up. That won't last us. Now, if I were you guys, when I go through this bridge, I have to take. Oh, forget it. We have to. Ouch. Hate this chapter. Just the first two levels. Because that's literally the worst of it. Alrighty. There's nothing there, sadly. I can explore this entire area, but look. No ammo, no supplies, no hope. Welcome to hell. Alright, let's toss the grenade to those buddies. Damn, we did not get the caco demon. I have no pistol. I thought we had a pistol. Oh yeah, because I did rifle star. Butthole. Let's get our health and try to keep our supplies up. Yeah, let them get as close as they can before shooting so you can do as much damage as possible. That was stupid of me. Alright, let's move forward. We're hurt, but it's not a big deal. So long as we don't die. There is one secret here, but I've never found it. Alright, get everything in here you can, and as soon as you open this door, throw a grenade. Yeah, because there's a lot of battles in there. And you want to conserve as much ammunition as possible. You're done. Fudge tunneler. Ah, I feel like I'm in the same exact condition as I was when I first tried to record this. Yes, that's the hell keep. Really short. Welcome to the slow of despair. Couldn't have been a more fitting name. Yeah, watch out. We have a shotgunner that way. Be nice if we can get them to fight each other. So I can save ammunition, but no, they're gonna be douchers like that. blow you up. I'd recommend avoiding that if you can, but I kind of need it. Because there's a mega armor here that's uh, around. Now we need to be extra careful here because supplies are going to be in demand. I don't know, sometimes enemies die really quickly. Sometimes they take an extra shot or two. I never understood why, but that's just the case. I even got really lucky in the first recording, got an invisibility and just started busting necks to save ammo, and even then I ran out of supplies and died. Yeah, like that. You can break necks if you sneak up on them or they're not aware of your presence. Come on guys, duke it out. Of course, you just had to exist, didn't you? I probably shouldn't have used the weapon more about Jesus Christ, that's one resilient skull. I blow you up. Watch out, we have trouble this way. Alright, we got everything. By the way, you couldn't free that marine we saw chained to a post. Well, uh, stabbed. There's nothing you can do except end his suffering. Hey there, buddy. How's it going? Ah, you're not looking too good. Alright, we're looking fine right now, but our health is really low. So maybe fix that? Alright, try not to panic too hard when you see these skull dudes. Oh, you son of a bitch. Thanks for taking the health we just restored. Take it easy and just blast his face off. I hate it when they do that. 
I call bullshit. There's no health, is there? We can check the right side. Please. And the game isn't going to be very merciful towards us, is it? Yay, one more hit and we instantly die. Well, hello there. I didn't find you before. You're looking rather beautiful today, aren't you, Rocket Launcher? Yes, you are. Yeah, we need to be careful because all in line in those little slots are uh, shotgun zombies and they'll end our life very quickly. Assuming the screaming skulls don't do that first. Huh. I didn't know you can melee with the pistol. We're gonna try to save some ammo by blowing their heads off. You're not slick! Damn caco demon. You guys are the worst of it. If we can take care of them, we'll have a chance. No. No, bad. Of course, we're trapped now. These are supposed to lower. I just forgot what. I just don't know what the stipulation is. Let's grab the armor shards, or bonuses, whatever you want to call them. They're called shards in the newest game, damn it. Alright, we have trouble this way, as per usual. Why wouldn't we? Yeah, it's very scary without auto aim on, and Brutal Doom and Project Brutality say no to auto aim. Yeah, I need to be very careful. One good hit from a Kako Demon would kill us. What's that do? Release trouble. Of course it does. Why wouldn't it? Fudge tunneling butt muncher. I don't like you evil demons. You need to die. You've given me enough trouble. Now funny enough, there's actually... Oh, for the love of God. Look how much that does! I keep getting hit! Oh shit. Yeah, there's legions of these jerks. Alright, let's kill you and jump up here. This is where the exit's going to be. I wish I could hit you now. Because I hate this level. Let's get our... Sh let's actually get our minigun ready because... Guess what? Yeah, trouble. More of it. We're gonna come across a spot with, uh... Oh, nice! That demon room gave us a lot of health. That's excellent. There's another spot where we could find a berserk health kit that would have restored us to full. Yeah, I see your little glowing eyes. We should actually head back in and get that mega armor inside the place. Let's go find it, because, yeah, there's mega armor in here. There it is. But perfect timing. I say, I say. Oh, where is it? There's a way to... I think it's right here. Yeah, there it is. That's supposed to... I guess that's only in Project Brutality. That's a Berserk Medikit. But whatever. Now we can enter that blue door. We came out very okay, actually. So onwards to the one more level. Pandemonium. 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 Anyone remember that Sega Saturn game? Yeah, we instantly get assaulted here. But we are doing very good on supplies, but this level isn't easy by any means. It's got some nasty things for us here. I'd suggest going this way first. If you're running low on armor or health. Because there's some stim packs here. And there's some decent supplies in this area. Like pinky demons. They're a good supply. Alright, good. He didn't chase after us. We can just let him drop. Yeah, there was a shotgun there. And over here, we have med kits. With some easy-to-kill uh, lost souls. 
I may not have looked. Yeah, we also have mega armor right over there. Funny enough, this can be one of the shortest levels in the game. If you make it so. I remember, I thought there was a secret in this area, but never mind, there isn't. Alright, let me move the mic up just a little bit so you guys can hear me better. I love the music. The metal remix makes it much better. We're not going to head down that way quite yet. I want to go to the other side first and get its goodies. Now we're going to head this way first because this way leads to just a dead end with a med pack that I need now. Thank you. We're like a scout. We lost 5 HP. Now we need to panic. Panic mode activated. Yeah, no. Yeah, this thing's right above our head. We can't jump. Now, whatever you do, do not press this eyeball switch. It only works once. Yeah, there's the starting area. Also, we got the blue key, and we can now beat the level. Yeah, if you hit that switch, you'll never be able to get up here and get this armor again. Oh yeah, and that floor is damaging. I forgot to mention that, but whatever. Now let's hit that pathway we didn't go before. Now, whatever you do, do not, I just repeat, do not go to that lava, because in this mod, it hurts. Alright, we need to be careful. Is it in this? Yes, it is. Fudge buckets. I hope that grenade got something. Yeah, there's a Baron of Hell. Why? Because reasons. Because Brutal Doom, that's why. Yeah, he gets confuzzled in the doorway, so that's your best way of killing him. It's like, duh, how do I door? He doesn't know how to door properly. Go through it, buddy. Now stop giving me the claw. This ain't no liar liar. Bitch. And we have a lot of nasty things, like I said. Alright, grab this god mode and rush back to that lava I told you not to go to. Because besides the enemies, we have a soul sphere. And I'd recommend getting that while you're in god mode so you can make the most use out of it. Alright, let's head this way now. Ooh, shotgun shells. Delicious. Yeah, the walls are moving. Your eyes aren't deceiving you. Aha, you can't hurt me, punk. Okay, now you can hurt me. They now have permission to hurt me again. No. No. You're not allowed to bite me. Yeah, their attacks are probably the most damaging in the game, and they can do it, well, not counting boss enemies. But those, uh, Kako Demons, the regular enemies, can do the most damage of any normal enemy in this game. Boss characters, that has the, the honor of that goes to the... Probably the final boss. Alright, let's head this way now. Yeah, watch out for the imps. We have some in there too. I guess there's only one this time. Well, hello, random pinky demon. You just existed. And now you're not existing. Alright, to the left we have a secret. And we also have trouble. Yeah, I saw your eyes. I was playing you know it with you. I hear another pinky demon. Could be a... There it is. That's what I was hearing. This will actually lead to the exit. Let me mute that. I'm sorry. I'm on my third account. And I didn't expect uh, anyone to message me. There we go. Now we are away. No one can talk to us. We'll run Do Not Disturb. Well, hi there. You just wanted to chat. Yeah, they want to chat too. They want to play biteys. I want to play Om Noms. And I'm the dinner. Too bad, I rebel. And then they quit. They rage quit. Yeah, look at that. He's trying to be a slick cacodemon. Fuck you. You know what? He'll give you a proper one. Fuck yourself! Thank you. My words exactly. Alright, down there. 
Okay, as I was saying, down here we have trouble. Blow it up. You take that trouble and fuck it in the ass. Yeah, that trouble didn't die. It wasn't fucked thoroughly enough. And when I say that, I don't mean it literally. Now, I would say grab this, but only if your blue armor is damaged to the point of where it's worth it. And right now, it's not worth it. Yeah, the rip and tear mode in this is almost next to useless. I saw I was wrong, this doesn't lead to the exit. This just leads to a secret. Oops. Haven't practiced these levels as much. Yeah, why did I was I slow slow to react there? I don't know. Yeah, what sense does this make? None. You are just gonna have to deal with it. Hi there. No hugs. The hugs are too violent. Violence the father. Our poor friend is dead. Ah, more trouble. Who's a good boy? Who's a good parent of health? That's the rocket. I don't think he caught it. He caught it with his face. That's what he caught it with. Yeah, fudge you and your huggies. You know how good that feels to pull that little bastard's head off. I love to make evil suffer. How do you like it? Oh, you're dead. Alright, let's head this way because over here we have mega armor. Now we're doing really good. Health could be better, but we're over 100, so that's good enough. Here, have a grenade. Ah, delicious. Oh, we had a sole survivor. Now he's not. Want to bet there's an enemy behind here? Ooh, you got tricked. Anyways, this ends this episode. So what else awaits us in hell? Well, the House of Pain, obviously. So what awaits us in the House of Pain and hell in general? Well, an ambush, of course. Yeah, stop it. I have an episode to end. Bastards, you're as rude as the enemies in the RPG were in GW Fans LP. I forgot what RPG it was. Where he was getting interrupted when he was trying to end the game. Anyways, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode of Brutal Doom.